Gaming Vault presents the 15 best Western games that let you play as a gunslinger. Big macho guys who took the untamed Wild West and the lore into their own hands, and rocked the five o'clock shadow like nobody's business. There was a time not so long ago when the John Waynes and the Clint Eastwoods dominated the anti-hero archetype, and Western gunslingers ruled the day. Gaming has put us in the boots of many a good, bad and ugly gunslinger many, many times over. Saddle up and join us to celebrate a fistful of gunslingers, won't you? Red Dead Redemption Of course, no list of games where you can be a gunslinger would be complete without Rockstar's western epic, Red Dead Redemption. The tale of John Marston takes the best elements of the open worlds that Rockstar is so good at making and gave it one of the classic Clint Eastwood-style stories of revenge and, well, redemption. And that glorious combination is what makes the game so beloved. It's only here on the list because of just how obvious it is. Call of Juarez Gunslinger A triumphant return to the Wild West for the series, Call of Juarez Gunslinger made itself far more memorable than it had any right to be by infusing the gunslinging shooting action of the post-Civil War West with the unreliable narrator that is Silas Greaves. The in-media res nature of the story is upended when missions will restart in their entirety to show you what actually happened and makes the events of the game a lot of fun. Mad Dog McCree A classic for the ages. Mad Dog McCree is a true gunslinger through and through. Putting you in the boots of The Stranger, who rides into an Old West town and requested to put down a gang of outlaws. Originally an arcade game, the appeal was that Mad Dog McCree put you in those tense quick-draw standoffs that cap off the best westerns ever. 12 is better than 6. As singularly stylish as Hotline Miami, which the game takes clear inspiration from, 12 is Better Than 6 takes the Twitch top-down shooting out of Miami and into the Wild West, with a strikingly monochromatic presentation and intense gameplay that fits the feeling of gunslinging. Oddworld Stranger's Wrath Fittingly as odd as the series namesake would suggest, Oddworld Stranger's Wrath is a wholly unique title that spins off the puzzle platforming Oddworld series into a irreverent Wild West parody where Stranger is using living creatures with different effects as crossbow ammo, all to hunt bounties in order to afford some kind of life-saving operation. The Gunstringer A gritty and serious drama is what mostly comes to mind when considering Wild West heroes. The Gunstringer, a Kinect Xbox 360 title from the minds that gave us Explosion Man, is not that kind of western. But the premise of a marionette play that you're controlling is carried through the entire experience in a really unique way, and the narrations and reactions of your audience is what gives this game its memorable style. Wild Guns Basically, true grit with robots. Wild Guns and its cast of playable characters fill out the gunslinging quota nicely with the stoic and stubbed Clint and the no-nonsense Annie who hires him to take on the Kid Gang. The recent remake to the SNES arcade classic adds the grenade-tossing Doris and Bullet, a literal dog in a robot. What more could you want? Gunman Clive The kind of Wild West aesthetics and a paper look that just draws you into the world isn't all Gunman Clive was going for. A tight platform game that takes clear inspiration from Mega Man and multiple playable characters that encourage replay makes Gunman Clive a great western adventure. Hard West Many of the games that feature a gunslinger obviously are shooters of some kind because it's the most natural fit. Hard West takes that in a wildly different direction, offering an XCOM-like turn-based strategy title that tells the tragic story of one man's tale of revenge, the supernatural, and his six-shooter. It is still a western after all. Fistful of Frags Among many titles with roots as a Source Engine modification, Fistful of Frags is a beautifully demanding multiplayer shooter set within the Wild West with some really unique combat mechanics that other shooters wouldn't dare touch. Give it a try if you're willing to quick draw at dawn Otherwise, you have until sundown to log out. Wild West Online 
One of the newer entries on this list, Wild West Online went out of early access on Steam just at the tail end of 2017 and started to kind of blow up. It's got a gorgeously realized world, and the generation of new content allows for a player to literally be that new stranger who wanders into town and solves their problems with his pistols. Why wasn't this done earlier? Lead and Gold, Gangs of the Wild West Did I hear you ask for a Team Fortress 2 but with gunslinging cowboys? Well, ask no longer. Lead and Gold, Gangs of the Wild West was this unique and oddly specific idea way back in 2010. The game incentivized team play with a synergy system that boosted your team by working together as one unit. Gun Colton White's adventure through Gun is notable for being Red Dead Redemption before Red Dead Redemption had been a thing, or anyone knew what Red Dead Revolver was. An open-world epic back when the PS2 ruled the landscape, the first-person quick-draw bullet time feature and unique stockpile of weapons made the game truly special. Outlaws A true classic from the most unexpected of places. Outlaws came from LucasArts during a time when they were best known for titles like Star Wars Dark Forces. While it wasn't compared favorably to Quake at the time of release, Outlaws did bring a few things to shooters that Quake did not, such as gun reloading and a sniper with a proper zoom. Dark Watch, Curse of the West Western and steampunk go together in so many media, like peanut butter and chocolate. But when High Moon Studios took that winning combination and introduced a splash of vampire mythos to the game, we had something really special. This 2005 PS2 game from Capcom gave us the story of outlaw gunfighted Cross, who was forcibly turned into a vampire in order to fight the supernatural forces that would destroy the world. Its brilliant use of gameplay mechanics within the ridiculous story made it a really engaging title and a fantastic gunslinging game. And that about does it for this video. If you enjoyed what you watched and want to see more from Gaming Bolt, you can always hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon next to it. That way you will never miss any of our videos.